update update time how's everybody doing so i was reading uh this morning about how one of my favorite zombies my favorite new zombie actually jeffrey gundlach gundlach he's all bearish on bonds now he's the new bond king remember he replaced bill gross uh formerly known as who's gonna buy them now remember that bill gross didn't even understand where the dollars came from to buy treasuries, but I digress. That's an old story. Anyway, Gundlach is now saying that interest rates have bottomed. Now, these zombies, they don't really understand why this stuff happens. And um, what I've said in the past is that every once in a while, because the zombies are always wrong. They're always wrong, but once in a while the zombies get it right, and they don't get it right because they understand they get it right because central banks or other monopolists, for whatever reasons, for their own reasons, decide to write those guys checks, all right? Decide to give those guys money because it is necessary, uh, as I said, for their own reasons, whether that's a policy decision or whatever, they, get, they, they write those guys checks and allow those guys to make money. So... Normally, the way markets function is you can have a bunch of stupid, ignorant, uh, misinformed people all do the same thing, and then they make money, right? That's what they all do, and that's why they lose most of the time. But every once in a while, they win, not because they get it right. They just happen to be on the right side of the monopolist's agenda. So it's basically like the monopolist is writing them checks, all right? And then that has... To that happens now, or it will happen now, when the Fed resumes its rate hikes, as I have been saying for a long time. Now, I get it right, and many of you who follow me get it right, because we understand. It's not a question of being lucky on the right side of the monopolist. I, I have to tell you, I'm even uncomfortable being on the same side as the zombies. But you have to understand that every once in a while, the zombies are allowed to make money the monopolists give them the money because they do that to um, realize some policy goal that they need to do. That's what's happening now, okay? So guys like Gundlach, who, by the way, if you remember back in mid-July, and I talked about this, he said, sell everything. Nothing is good. Sell stock. He was shorting stocks. And I said, you got to go against this guy. And I was right. Okay, I was right. Once again, because I'm always right, because I understand. I've said it in the past. If you have the right information, if you have the right understanding, if you have the right mental game, all right, this is not bragging, all right? This is not cockiness. This is not arrogance. This is just science, people. That's all it is, is science. All right, so... We're on the side of the zombies now, uh, or I should say they are on our side, not because they understand. I mean, we've, we've understood what was going on for a long time, or I've understood what was going on for a long time. The zombies didn't. Now they're just making a call, and they've always said that, you know. Bonds are going to crash. The stock market's going to crash. The Dow's going to go down below 1,000. Gold's going to go to 10,000. We're going to have hyperinflation, right? The Chinese are not going to lend to us. All crazy shit. They keep saying. Once in a while, it looks like they get it right, but they only get it right because the monopolists allow them to get it right because it's, um, it's necessary for them uh to achieve whatever policy goal they want or whatever price goal they want i should say it like that you know monopolists don't o only have to be central banks you know they could be oil producers like the saudis they allowed the zombies who were short oil from you know late uh 2014 through 2015 they allowed them to make money because it was in the interest of the Saudis, probably the United States government that wanted to screw with Russia, wanted to screw with Iran, they wanted to push down oil prices, so the zombies were allowed to make money, but they gave most of it back. I'm sure when I made that call, the oil has bottomed last February. 
<laughs> this is easy, folks. It's very easy. Anyway, I'll be working on MMT Trader all this weekend. By the way, for those of you who don't have your 30-day free trial, go to www.pitbulleconomics.com and sign up for it. Click on the tab that says Products. And while you're there, you could also order my Forex course. And understanding the daily treasury statement, best 99 bucks you're ever going to uh, invest in. And the MMT uh, value stock selection course, 99 bucks was a $600 course now, 99 bucks. Just on the, click on the tab that says courses. By the way, one guy bought that course. He's been sending me stock recommendations after just following that course. He's been sending me some amazing stock recommendations that I haven't even discovered. Guy just watched the video, and now he's like a pro at stock selection. Never did that before. Amazing, amazing stock selections. So go get it. See you later. Bye-bye.